but I can still imagine there's probably still a lot of issues. I don't know. I've been playing on, um, on, of course, uh, I, this the entire time, uh, c c computer. What did it actually say on screen here? I don't know. How does that happen? Why does, why does, I do not understand why OBS keeps doing that sort of thing. Do other people have this issue where, like, they just constantly get text appearing on screen? Ah, terrible. I'm deleting that right now. Pro streamer? You know I'm not. Do I have, like, some sort of... Ah, uh, whatever. Anyway. Continuing on here. Okay, new alpha, a lot of changes. And I'm uh, really looking forward to especially dealing with some of the uh, apparently huge alterations to how, uh, how malaise works. But hey, we finally got Katana. There we are. There it is. <laughs> All right. No custom game, normal mode. We'll just uh, really get on with this here. After forgetting to turn the stream to 60 frames a second and everything like that, that was kind of embarrassing. But, you know, man. I mean, it's like a... I don't know. Look, let's just ignore what happened there and the random text appearing on screen and check out this new skin that we got for the explosive crossbow. Yeah, that is just completely new now, eh? It doesn't look like that. Oh, they took out the uh, the full combo. I kind of remember them saying that they were gonna do that recently, but I don't. I didn't. I didn't realize what that was. Uh, backpack everywhere. Yeah, a lot. Of, a lot of different stuff. Deciding not to load today. What is going on now? <laughs> is there more stuff happening here? Okay. Now come on. They took that out last update. Uh, what, the um, custom mode or something? Is there going to be a VOD? Yeah, probably. I'll figure out. I'll, we'll, we'll go find like a good run or something, and I'll just uh, VOD that up. I was thinking about doing the entire thing, but uh, it seems like the stream is not really cooperating in the way that I would like it to right now. You know how it is. Now, let's keep going with uh, uh, tactics with the hope that I probably see that katana eventually. Wait, no, it's not actually tactics. It's brutality scale. It just would make a lot of sense if it was tech. What, what the hell? <laughs> That's a new enemy. Oh, yeah. How is uh, Malaise working? Okay, where's the katana? I mean, you just want to do a katana run right now? Because we can do that. Sure. You want this to be the inaugural official katana run? So, do a new weapon showcase. Oh, man, look at that. That would be good for a katana run if I was going to do that. All right, well, uh, let's do that then. Yeah, we good, we good. I think we good. Favor speedrun style. I was told that it doesn't favor speedrun style. I was told the exact opposite. Literally the exact opposite. Okay, uh, well. New alpha and a new weapon. So that means that I'm going to be trying that one out right now. Literally never even touched this thing before. So I think this one's going to be very interesting. Especially because this is a uh, something that fans have been asking for for a very long time. The katana. Does it have like any... Ah, uh, is that like a charge up, or is that just like a part of the combo? I think that is a yeah, that is a charge attack, and it basically looks like light speed, except in the form of a well, actual attack rather than more of a you know utility type of deal. Also, seems to hit pretty far in front of you, so that's going to be a lot of fun. Unfortunately, wasn't actually uh, tactic scaling like I thought it was going to be. Feels like if you're trying to go for a very fast. Uh, Okay, 
Uh, feels like if you're going to be trying to go for like a very fast melee weapon like this one, that you would probably want it to be tax scaling, but I guess I've largely taken that out in this newest alpha update. You can change the crits by canceling before the dash. Like... Uh, I also see that it does uh, burst into like a bunch of flower pebbles, which is interesting. <laughs> okay, so if much like the... Uh, okay, maybe this is kind of like a weird reference here, but do you remember that one bit in uh, Kirby Superstar where you were doing the... Um, the, uh, what was it, Samurai minigame, something like that? I do not remember what it was called. This is like, I, this always reminds me of that in particular. Anyway... <laughs> Uh, professional content maker. Wait, what now? And immediately took tactics. <sighs> Fine, we'll do it over again then. The reflex challenge. Is that what it was called? Huh. Um. Here, you want to go put on dumb ninja outfit for memes? I know that's what you all are here for. The memes. You don't even care anything about me. You just want the memes. All right. Get right in the middle there because you can't have a good run if you don't start in the middle. Okay, okay. Get it. It's the memes, Doc. I'm giving them to you. Ugh. All right, so did you read the patch notes? Of oh, a little bit of them. All right, all right. Uh, let's start this one up here. New alpha. That means that we get a new weapon to go along with it. And this one is one that has been requested for a very, very long time. It's the katana. That's right. It's finally here, performing for you with a very interesting type of critical. Uh, has an entire spray of petals along with it. Slash through apparently an entire line of enemies, sort of light speed style, and you get a huge crit on top of all of that. And yet, for some reason, as I had to restart a run because of this, it is not actually tactic scaling. I guess they've largely taken that out in the latest update in favor of uh, just making it mostly ranged at this point in time. That combined with a generally huge change up apparently to the way malaise works means that this is going to be quite the interesting run <laughs> i don't know i'm gonna i'm gonna try to adjust as i'm going here but i'm really not quite sure what to expect because i didn't really read the patch notes too closely you know as i do now i've been apparently told that you can cancel out the dash to get a different critical but i haven't quite figured that out like, no, it wasn't like, I wasn't able to roll in the middle of that, which is kind of strange. So I'm not quite sure how to, how to do it if I possibly can. Ah, well, we'll see. In the meantime, hey, everybody, welcome to the stream. I guess, uh, you know what? I, I was told that apparently this has been changed up quite a bit and is also no longer scaling with brutality. And also just in general is like weaker. So maybe it's, it'll be a little bit more balanced. Oh, that did not actually give me any sort of malaise reduction either. Oh, that's a lot of fun. Well, anyway, I'm not going to worry too much about it. Like I say, I mean, people said more of a more of a speed run style. But they're expect you're expected to be doing higher cell difficulty and more of a speed run style. So you know, it is uh, it behooves me to maybe try and not attack every single enemy possible and just kind of run through here or not. I don't know. I'm still kind of learning at this point in time. All of these good tactics weapons and still not scaling with tactics. It's so unfortunate. I wonder if we still get like the uh, the predator mutation and everything because I don't know how that's going to work. That was kind of like the, the plan at the very start here before I knew it was totally gone. Goodbye. Predator is brutality now. Well, should I take it for the memes? Because I know, once again, we have already established you all are only here for the memes. So, you know. Good, good. And, well, I mean, that should be basically everything. 
Yes, Predator is good. All right, let's go. Tainted Flask is broken with the melee change. Ah, that's too bad. Doesn't really surprise me at all, though, if, um, if the, uh, uh, you know, the way everything works is entirely different, too. Oh, I also noticed the Smoke Bomb is scaling with Brutality now, which is kind of interesting. Once again, more memes. Oh, right. I can could, I could backpack stuff. I keep forgetting about this sort of thing. <laughs> Uh, all these changes, man. Can't quite uh, get used to it. Well, anyway, let's see the backpack one that people were talking about. Uh, apparently a backpack mutation, I guess. And then I'm also going to... I don't really want the 100% damage. Yeah, there's initiative. Uh, porcupine backpack. I'll get that afterwards. Oh, yeah, there's an entirely uh, different bunch of things in here. So got tactical retreat. <laughs> really? Berserker is now a survival. I, I, I guess that makes sense. Hmm. Interesting if true. I wonder if that works with the the Scythe Claws. Heart of Ice still looking about the same. Tortoise Wheel. Anything else interesting? How does this work? Uh, each kill restores, reduces... Uh, yeah, nothing new there. Decreased by half. Huh. Well, anyway, uh, let's take Predator for right now and Porcupine Backpack after this. Okay. All mutations with malaise properties have those disabled. Oh, that's too bad, because that was the easiest way to do, do stuff, you know? Oh, <laughs> is there a new diet? <laughs> Okay, I'll do it. Uh, let's let's check it out. I was like doing new. T yep, there it is. The cheeses, and I have uh, described myself as basically being cheese uh, hyper tolerant because I eat that all the time. Okay, then that's an interesting change up for this area. Certainly. Ah, now then. <laughs> also, enemies just kind of spawning around. That's cool. Oh well. Uh, I, no, I don't really know exactly what I'm going to be doing in terms of... Can't backpack that. Uh, but, yeah, let's d d do this for eventual backpacking goodness. Now then. How's your diet coming along? Uh, it's still full of cheese? It's true. In case you were wondering. Come on now. Now nah, whatever. Doesn't even matter all that much. Uh, I don't know how you lower malaise then, because it seems quite a bit trickier than usual. Now we get the real nothing personnel kid. Finally. Also cool. I love seeing of all enemies to be spawning, these guys, and now they're turning into elites. I, I think I'm okay. I... I, I think I'm alive. Interesting if true. Out of here already. And of course, nothing to be had there. Oh, well. Ah, uh, anyway, uh, this is definitely a lot of changes that I'm seeing right now, which is interesting. It certainly makes it different when you can't really... You know, enemies are already teleporting to me, and now they are also... Oh, great. Uh, enemies are already teleporting to me, and now they are also um, literally spawning next to me, which is a lot of fun. I don't know how I'm going to be able to deal with this, but I guess we'll just have to see over time. As it is, though, I still feel pretty confident with this uh, uh, setup right now, because it is pretty good. <laughs> I'm having a good time with it. Well, anyway, it's just <laughs> finally getting a katana. I, I guess this is kind of what I expected. I was sort of hoping for the uh, one tactics two-hander that I originally like was uh, talking about, I think, all the way back when... Oh, oh man, the rare uh, five-cell mode archer. When I was originally talking about that, uh, when I think the Scythe Claw was first introduced but didn't quite happen in that way. Are you still not dead yet? 
Man. These things are still pretty tanky, but could also be that I just need to get a few more um, a few more statages here before I really start having this uh, run pop off just yet. That said, I do quite like the big critical. Not a big fan of that, though. Oh, come on now. Fine, then. <laughs> Ah, oh, well, I'm sure that there will be something here that will allow me to uh, heal up quite a bit. Especially now that food is apparently, you know, no longer malaised up or anything like that. It should be significantly easier to uh, heal that sort of thing. I mean, after all, there are a lot of opportunities to get that sort of thing where I didn't really... Uh, what's, oh, no, I think that's the cheese that I was talking about. Oh, dang it! Come on! I didn't even get the chance to check it out. <laughs> Food can be malaised. Huh. Well, this is going to be interesting. Well, let's check that one out again. You got cheese? No, I didn't. I just got, um, I just got hit by an elite that I didn't know was going to have that ability on it, unfortunately. But hey, that doesn't really matter too much. It's like we can jump right back in there very easily, considering how early on it was in the run. Okay. Oh, people try and get me to read patch notes. Little do they know that I'm not going to do that. Anyway. <laughs> yeah, it seems like the crit... How much is the critical? Yeah, it's, it's only a little bit here. Okay. That's going to be something to remember, I suppose. Um... Over there, over time, as I'm trying to get used to this. Good. All right. Um, you know, I think I might actually just like start the uh, start start the episode over. Because like we did just stop right at the very beginning there. Yeah. So let's uh, let's just do that one. Ah, give me one second here. Talk about Samurai Kirby again. No, <laughs> never. Read chat. Nah. Uh, anyway. All right, new alpha. And this time we finally got fan favorite Katana. <laughs> that's not actually true at all. That's, that's nothing. Um, hmm. Sup peeps, eat cheese on stream. No. That would require me to go and get things for that, which I refuse. Cheese cam. What would that even be in any respect? Doc, play some royalty-free Japanese flute music. No. We're not doing just all the stereotype stuff right now. At least put on the new snowman skin. Fine. Where is it? Oh. <laughs> Great. <laughs> all right, y'all ready to go? <laughs> As I'm sure you can already tell, there is a new alpha out. And this one includes a weapon that people have been asking for for a very, very long time, the katana. Which, oh boy, this one seems interesting. Fast, also gets sort of a light speed dash into a critical, which I am... I'm still a little bit divided on. It doesn't quite seem like the damage is there for the amount of wind-up that it requires. But at the same time, it is interesting enough that we're going to be doing a run on it today. So I hope y'all are ready for, um, this, whatever this is. <laughs> what a strange outfit to put in the game, too, I just want to say. But, uh, I don't even know what else to say about that. It, it barely even, like, looks anything like anything else we've seen. Oh, uh, whatever. Let's just go. Uh, and yet, at the same time, not tactic scaling. 
quite unfortunate because it's like, I, I remember when I was like thinking about what a katana would be like in this game, all the way back when they first introduced like the Scythe Claw, I was thinking, you know, uh, two-handed, uh, two-handed tactics weapon, and yet, not quite like that anymore. Well, that said, it's just like, hey, everything that was like for, mm -hmm, everything that was like for, uh, tactics melee is now in brutality, so it should be roughly about the same thing. It's not quite the same amount of uh, secondary skills that I can have with this. I don't know. We'll see. I think the real goal is going to be to try and get a phaser so that I can finally do the true nothing personnel kid. Ah, uh, meme. Like, <laughs> Dead Cells was always meant to be played. Of course, I still got a little bit of time before we get there. Also, new malaise mechanics, which, uh, I don't, I don't really know exactly how this thing works, but, because I have no idea how to get rid of malaise, but... I guess it is no longer based on uh, getting hit by enemies, but instead just kind of goes up over time. Real speed run mechanic, which I think is going to be something to get used to, but at the same time, considering how I usually play the game, I don't know. Wow, don't even have the, the wolf trap scaling with tactics anymore. They really got rid of most everything for the assassin build, didn't they? It's a little bit too bad, but... At the same time, I don't really think that too many people were using that, right? I, I can't imagine that, like, uh, Melee Tactics had been a tremendously popular way of playing the game. I know, at least for me, it was quite difficult to do. Oh, dang, there was Phaser right there. Ah, well, uh, let's just get, get on here. I think this is going to be mostly a traditional run. Don't really see too much reason to be... Uh, kind of like going a bunch of alternate routes when this is a weapon that I've never really used before. Used for about five seconds before dying stupidly <laughs> in the, the promenade. So yeah, let's keep it simple, keep it safe. That said, hey, Katana otherwise seems pretty good. It reminds me, uh, the uh, like downward swings actually remind me a lot of like the giant killer. A weapon that I do quite like, but... You know, aside from that, it just otherwise is, like, ah, a brutality weapon. The light speed dash being incorporated into a weapon, though, is interesting, because it sort of does make it feel like, why even bother taking that anymore now, you know? I guess it still does have a lot of iframes and everything, but, you know. Oh, this one is infected, so... I'm a bear. Hmm. That's... Interesting. I don't know what that means, considering there doesn't seem to be any way to get rid of malaise, but <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. That said, you know, it is a... It is kind of... I, I gotta say, it is kind of fun to go all the way back to, like, OG Dead Cells, when the game would, like, be a different game between each update. There's something just a lot of fun about that. The melee weapon and backpack, well, let's take Predator for right now, just because, again, nothing personnel, kid, and uh, grab that in the next area. You can take infected food after the malaise of the lever level is cleared. I don't know what that means. <laughs> What's the homunculus rune look like? Uh, yeah. Yep, about what I expected. <laughs> okay. Bust right through that door, and... This is not the traditional type of snowman. It's more of like a slime man. <laughs> Which is good, that gets you a 40% uh, projectile resistance in Noita. Ah, <laughs> uh, the level, you get a level clear message after killing 90% of the enemies. Oh boy, that's way too much. I am never gonna do that. <laughs> you know how I play this game, and it's not fighting enemies. Cause that puts you at more risk than is, eh. What is this one? Griere, okay. It, it does look like a gigantic hunk of Swiss cheese, but I suppose I haven't had that. And the other thing looks like Brie, but uh, whatever. Look, it's, it's all good. Uh, just get 60 kills. Ugh. Also, far too difficult. Throwing knife again for the nothing personnel, but <laughs> no, I don't know. I already got a bloodthirsty shield. I don't really need too much of anything else. Let's just get on with the run proper. Look, if we're going to be doing it, 
you know, if we're going to be doing fast speed run styles to deal with the new hurdles that have been placed before me, I got to start going much faster and more speed running. I do like the idea of an invisible snowman. That amuses me a lot. <laughs> Uh, 59. Who has a 59 emote? <laughs> oh, that's for FPS. <laughs> I'm just like, are you kidding me? Are, are, is that really this common of a problem? I just assumed that uh, I was the only one. But I guess a Slipknot would say I'm not the only one. Their hit song, Psychosocial. Anyway, uh, continuing on. There we go, and now it became elite. This is a lot of fun. I think this has something to do with the malaise, but I, I don't know. <laughs> I only really know how this works. Oh, I was thinking of the Rolling Stones. No, much worse than that. <laughs> like the idea even that I would be referencing the Rolling, the Rolling Stones rather than Slipknot. Didn't Slipknot appear in the Suicide Squad movie? movie? Uh, the the uh, villain, not the, not not the band. <laughs> what is that skin? Oh, this is the the standard skin that you can that uh, you get in Dead Cells these days. It's actually the only one that you can play as. So I hope you're kind of used to it because I don't think it's gonna be going away at least until like maybe like March. If I if I remember what Motion Twin was saying, I don't know. There we are, and whatever, that works. <laughs> uh, with the, you're not the only one. Yeah, no, no, I know. But I was, again, uh, unless that was also a Suicide Squad type of reference. I'm not entirely sure. <laughs> How do you even mix them up? I don't know. You'll have to ask somebody else, not myself, who did not. Give me that. Yeah, it doesn't reduce the malaise anymore. And yet, who can be malazed? <laughs> Checkmate, atheists. Mm, that's unfortunate, though. All right, and... Oh, that was just... I, 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 I almost faced the wrong direction there. But I didn't, so it's good. Killing enemies reduces the malaise? Ugh, I guess I'm never going to reduce the malaise then. <laughs> this is going to make it really easy to get all of the... Uh, all of the um, blueprints you could ever want, I suppose. Maybe they uh, prevent you from getting that in... Um, uh, with, like, these summoned enemies, but it seems like that would be pretty convenient, considering they seem to be from literally anywhere in the game. <laughs> I don't know. There we go. Parfait. Truly, this is the stupidest Dead Cells run I've done in quite a while. Oh, uh, boy. Nope. Get out of here, you. How about a high malaise run? I, I, are we kind of already doing that to a certain extent? I don't see this going down anytime soon, really. There we are. Doesn't turn into a snowball when he rolls. Oh, that is a missed opportunity. You're right. <laughs> Unfortunately, it's like, what can you say? I'm not motion twin. Well, maybe I am. But you'll never know. Well, I mean, come on. We're going full on in invisibility, right? I guess. Although I do need a, another uh, melee weapon for just generally trying to... Okay, come on. Uh, I do need another melee weapon if I'm going to be trying to uh, use the, the backpack mutation as it exists. Because I don't think it's going to be usable in any other way. Yep. Uh-huh. 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 And I guess that exploded? Good. Oh boy, I didn't even think about what the wall running animation was going to look like for this guy. <laughs> uh, anyway. I mean, it's basically exactly what you thought it was going to be. Terrible. 
And anything else to do? I suppose I'm going for like, ah, eh, whatever. Let's just go for the prison depths anyway. Twice on the same ball and chain. Indeed. <laughs> now that's it. Ah, uh, anyway. What was I going to get here? Right, the backpack mutation. Um, Probably be able to use that in the next area. No unique animations for that or anything, but uh, we'll see. Go for Mama Tick? I don't know about that. I mean, I guess that would... No, how would that work if you're doing, like, the light speed dash, dash in there? <laughs> No, not quite what I was looking for. Needless to say, I was hoping for a melee weapon, but, uh, that's fine. Oh. Yeah, first time. Because this is the... Because this is a, um... New save file and everything. Oh, come on now. I feel like that's a little bit unfair. All right, come on now. And one more. I guess they're going to at least make this easy to get rid of curses, if nothing else. I'm not a big fan, though, needless to say. Uh-huh. There we are. Man. <laughs> Rough. Malaise. No, Malaise is doing just fine. What are you even talking about? Like, this is totally normal and good. Basically, your average dead cells, right, if you were to ask me. Ah. And there we go. I don't know. It seems pretty easy so far to deal with a lot of this sort of stuff. Just need to get, like, the right amount of... I think I will actually take a little bit more burst damage. Just, you know, for reasons. I won't say what those reasons are, but they are manifold. All right. Ah, dang. It's okay, though. I've dealt with... Oh! Do want to go get that real quick. Anyway, uh, I am going to take a potion charge here. I know it's maybe not, like, the best idea or anything, but, uh... It's fine. Now then. Um, I would like extra, you know, jumps, but I think that'll work out for right now. Oh, anyway, anyway. Um, let's take a nice, relaxing trip through the Challenge Rift. You know how it goes. Want to make sure that it's, like, it, it's not too difficult or anything. Get, like, all of my uh, cooldowns off of cooldown. How the hell did you see that? I was paying attention. How did, did you not see that? I thought chat had such eagle eyes for the challenge rifts. <laughs> and people make fun of me for that. Oh, boy. Damn. <laughs> Not with so many enemies? Man, you guys suck at seeing those things, I guess. I can't really... Nobody can ever make fun of me for missing one of those... Uh, nobody can ever make fun of me for uh, missing one of those challenge drifts ever again. I'm just going to say right now. But yeah, I couldn't get into the... Uh, I could not get into the... Um... Oh, I'm trying to even think of what it's called. Uh, the teleporter in time there. So, yeah. Kind of how that goes. That's why you kill more people. I'm not going to kill anybody in this first area. Show you. <laughs> it's 
like, oh, we're going from, ah, they can't see challenge rifts to blah, blah, whatever. Now you got to kill more enemies. Nope. I refuse. Ah. <sighs> Now then, continuing on here, though. Still at zero. That tells pacifist run? That's kind of what we're doing here. I'll, I'll consider that it, that to a certain extent. Purely powered by spite. <laughs> okay. Keep going on here. I want to find that second. Gotta find that second uh, stat though before I get out of here. Oh, well, that's unfortunate. Not quite the area that I want to get to. Nope, oh, got hit though. That's okay. It seems like it's at least for right now a pretty manageable amount of damage though. At least we remove almost one full malaise. Well, I guess we're not gonna find that out uh, if that's true anytime soon. Oh, there's where I'm supposed to be going. We get the pacifist chest at the end of the area, I can only hope. I'd be okay if uh, Dead Cells added something like that, but somehow I imagine that they're probably not going to be... Wait, how did an... Apparently an enemy died somewhere. I'm not even entirely sure where or how. <laughs> nah, I'm not going to be able to get anything there, especially not if I'm not killing enemies. Okay. Wait, did I get all the stats? I mean, I guess I must have, right? Ah, oh, well. I should be good. Might have YOLO'd? Yeah, I might have YOLO'd. Okay, let's see here. They died because of overpopulation. It's true. It's a sad thing to happen, but... Oh, wait, no, I should have actually taken that. Well, uh, I guess we'll have to go for another pacifist run in the next area, too. <laughs> out of spite. <laughs> Remember, it's entirely out of spite. Oh, wait, I shouldn't take that if I'm trying to go pacifist. Are you still recording? Absolutely, I'm still recording. <laughs> no weapons or skills run when? I did that back in the Brutal update. Oh, unfortunately, yeah, there's nothing I can do about the bats exploding. They just do that on their own. So, yeah, that is going to be a way that enemies die regardless, unfortunately. Now then. Green demon challenge, and we're good. Kill more enemies. <laughs> I tell you. That's the that's the words of people that don't know how to play the game. If anything, it's easier not killing any enemies. <laughs> Spit run. <laughs> uh, I guess that's not quite what I'm looking for, but I'll, I'll take whatever right now. Um. Hey, y'all. We lost the music. <laughs> All right, then. So, uh, what's going on? Or maybe I just lost the music. Give me one second. Um, hello, Dead Cells? Mm, yeah, I don't... I don't know. Oh, dang. <laughs> that was not me. That was them hitting me and dying anyway. You turned the music off. I mean, give me one second. Give the music back. Give me one second here. I just figure this. I'm just going to restart the game. Because... We had it. Well, oh, okay. Fine, then. <laughs> I didn't have it, though. Oh, 
audio source was lost? I mean, the audio source is currently on my head right now, so. Shit, whisper me sweet nothings. There we go. <laughs> anyway, continuing on here. Ah. Bruh. Fortunate that I got hit there. I'm probably going to have to go use a potion charge or something soon enough. Okay. Just a few more elites. Totally fine. Totally reasonable. No, wait. Not survival. Now then. Oh, thank you, Excalibro. I hope you're enjoying this fight run. <laughs> I am. Ah, and six? I can do better than that. By the way, am I getting covers in flammable oil, freezes enemies? Yeah, that shouldn't kill any enemies. Enemies. What? Why is it not working now, though? Is the question. Did they change something with this once again? The answer is, I don't know. Maybe. Ah, totally normal run in the world of dead cells. You get the new mixer? I did not. I don't know where it is. Oh. Yeah, like I said, I'm probably going to have to use a potion charge at this rate. It's unfortunate because it's like, yeah, I'm going to lose all that cool malaise that I gained. But I think it's more important to not kill enemies right now. As my pacifist lifestyle demands. Okay. Like that. Can't use it, of course, but you know how it goes. Are you going to defeat bosses as pacifist? I mean, it's just for the first couple areas. I don't really have any plans to be doing it anywhere past that, but, you know. For the time being, it's working out just fine. Now, what do we got? Da -da -da, da -da, one scroll. I it, Somebody did say that I missed a scroll, and I guess it was right there. Uh, enemy spawn animations. I mean, they've had those spawn animations for actually a very long time. Due to the way that elites used to work, they uh, would create little tiny uh, runner zombies, they were called back in the day. And that's just the same one that they use there. It's also the same one that they use for when uh, zombies get up out of the ground in, like, the... Uh, the... Uh, graveyard. There we go. Took me a second there. Didn't even break the door. The doors are not alive. I'm not I'm not under pacifist run rules for that. Fragment? Oh, did I miss a fragment? Oh, I did. Does the katana give malaise? No, this is just what the, the game is like right now. They've been uh, kind of tinkering with how that works and everything. Malaise and its uh, effects. Okay. Fragment. I got the fragment. It's cool. Anything else that I'm missing before I go through that door? No, we're good. Fragment. Oh, oh, I didn't realize you were talking about frog moments. <laughs> That's totally different. This is a real frog damn moment. I think I'm actually just going to take acceptance right now. <laughs> Considering how it's, um, how it's due. It seems like it's worth it to kill all enemies in the biome. Ah, whatever. It's fine. Ooh. I mean, I can't really use this too much, but I'm at least going to keep it for, uh, the time being. Just make sure that I can get rid of this a little bit easily. When do to spawn in boss arenas when you have a lot of malaise? I guess we're going to find out. <laughs> Ah! Damn it. Always. Ah. Pacifist run. We'll do a real pacifist run this time. I suppose I should probably reset the episode, right? All right, here. Let's do that one right now. Yes, it is very sad. All right, all right. 
So. As I'm sure you can tell, there is a new update on Horizon. That means that we got a new alpha. And that means also, one of the fan favorites, or at least one of the most fan requested items, has been added into the game. The Katana. It's kind of a uh, fast, brutality scaling attack weapon. But you can also hold it down to do something of a light speed dash, which also does critical damage. It's interesting. I don't know if it's necessarily too much better than a lot of the the other brutality weapons that exist out there, but still, the fact that it exists in the game at all is pretty cool. I don't know. I'm going to have to see kind of how it works, but as it is, uh, I'm also going to have to kind of focus on all the other many, many changes that have now happened to Dead Cells. For example, stuff like just having the the uh, backpack naturally in the game and maybe most damning, a lot of changes to how malaise works in general, making it a lot different more unusual compared to how it was before. No longer do I have to worry about getting hit by enemies too many times. Now it's all about uh, trying to speed run through areas and kill as few enemies as possible. At least that's what chat's been telling me. So, it's kind of how I've been playing the game. It seems very difficult to be honest, but uh, we'll kind of like uh, see how I adjust to it over time. Nothing. Needless to say, I of course do want to get the phaser immediately to go full on nothing personnel kid. Now that I have the katana, it's only, uh, it only makes sense, after all. Nice try, but they can't read chat. Chat does not exist for people on YouTube. <laughs> Sorry, YouTube people, you don't get to see the, the great, the great chat that I have. Anyway, um, uh, sell that, and I continue going on here, and see what's happening. Something about Samurai Curvy? Yeah, we can talk about that. The the reflex minigame where you uh, press A at the right time to like dash through enemies. I always like that one. One of my favorites of Kirby Superstar. Of course, my real favorite of Kirby Superstar was the um, was the Milky Way Wishes. I just loved being able to switch out copy abilities on the fly like that. It was very cool. Well, Hemorrhage. Hemorrhage does scale with brutality, which is interesting. It used to scale with survival. I guess we'll grab that. Sure. But we'll see. New enemy, Demolisher, uses the explosive crossbow. Yeah, that makes sense. And I think that works a little bit better than, like, knife throwers, which are a pretty rough first uh, first addition to the... the uh, addition to the first area. So I think that that's somewhat more reasonable, even though it's clearly a lot more powerful than uh, regular archers, comparatively. Ah... Uh, Predator, I think, works best, like, thematically with a run. But, of course, there's also Porcupine Backpack, which is the new thing. Doesn't really mean too much when I have a shield in there. I think that's for the survival one, right? Yeah, which is... Eh, parry stuff. Parries while you roll through... Huh, that's neat. Um, but... Also... This, I really seriously wonder if, works, if it works with the... Uh, the Scythe Claws, because that is quite a combination, if that's true. Switching weapons. Also, just something that encourages switching weapons is uh, pretty unique in Dead Cells, I would say. Usually, you just kind of want to have, like, one main hand and one, like, uh, utility weapon in, in, in your uh, arsenal. I don't know. Feels like you'd want to kill every enemy so you could stop the malaise from going up fast. Maybe? I don't know. Might be something to try a little bit later, but of course, right now I'm focused on winning, so. Can't, uh, I cannot deviate from that, uh, that, uh, level of, uh, like, being in the zone, you know? Fortunately, nothing I can do here about killing those enemies because they die on their own. <laughs> but, hey, I can try as much as I can to avoid killing anything else. Scythe Claw Redo? I mean, <laughs> I don't know, man. I feel like a... For right now, Scythe Claw. I, I, want this, I like that episode a lot, especially because it was, at the time it was still like super overpowered. It had not been nerfed at all, so it's like you got just the most, um, no, oh, his phaser. You got just the most um, uh, damage that you could possibly get out of that thing. And just in general, I think it's a good episode. And that's not only because it has nearly half a million views at this point, but also maybe a little bit because of that. Oh. Okay, come on now, guys. 
I'm gonna have to use a potion charge, unfortunately. Yeah. Unfortunately here, but... but... Oh, come on now. The one spike that exists there. Oh, we'll never know because I keep dying. Yeah, it's pretty rough. Look, nobody's gonna say that Dead Cells isn't currently very difficult. So, I mean... Now, yeah, what do you got for, like, the star thing? 50% at max HP seems okay. I'll enjoy your failings, then. I'll continue. It's certainly... That's certainly been the case right now. All right, but anyway. Um, there we are. Ah... Uh. Unfortunately, yeah, now as it is, it seems like it might be with all these changes and how they're kind of like weirdly balanced, a little bit too difficult to do a proper showcase run. So I think it's probably going to be largely just a, um, <laughs> of course. The explosion does actually affect you, which is something to remember. 1,000 hour dead cells pro for the memes? What do you mean memes? Oh, ah. Uh. Didn't mean to have to, I uh, see. I attacked that enemy, and now I got I got a point of malaise. See, that's how it works. Okay. Oh, dang it! I I I see. I got the um. I see. I got the uh, I got the the roll creates a bomb, which unfortunately killed a rat. Invalidating this run. You have to strike it from speedruns.org. .gov. <laughs> now then. I'll try to at least avoid uh, killing as many enemies as possible, as usual. As required in the games that exist right now. <laughs> okay. Ah, dang. I'm trying here, but it's pretty rough. Okay. Anything else that I want to get here before continuing on? Maybe I'll go check out one of the other areas here first. Any uh, new melee weapons in the custom mode? Just this one, as far as I've seen. I don't think there's anything else that's new right now. Oh, right. I need to go get the key first. I forget, because, like, you don't need this after this point, so... And there we are. And there we are. Anything else I'm missing? No. We're good. All right. Didn't even read the change log? I don't. I, n I never read the change log for anything. Oh, whoops. Did not mean to do that. <laughs> uh. Damage take inflicted on the enemy. Thick mama tick? We'll see. I don't know. As of right now, it's still kind of like up in the air as to... I should probably take this right now. Two-handed weapons have different affixes on each slot? Interesting. Hmm. Ah, because you're such a troll? Is it really trolling to... Uh, you know, keep everything nice and fresh and new? People like the first reaction stuff. I don't know what you're talking about. Okay. Snowman with a uh, with a shield is kind of weird looking. Uh, of course, what isn't? Ah, dang! I ought to read change logs when other people do it for me. Exactly. <laughs> I'll figure it out as I'm going. It's fine. All right. And Okay. Gotta thread that needle, but it's actually working out just fine right now. 
Oh, there is a scroll fragment over there. I should probably go get that. How does the new malaise work? I'm not entirely sure just yet, but it seems to like summon up enemies and make enemies elite as you gain it. Which, of course, is a lot different than, you know, killing you. I guess I can appreciate that, but still. The issue that I have is that he did misinform YouTube about this, uh, the spiel about malaise. Oh, this isn't going up on YouTube. Ah! I think with the way the game works, it's a little bit too, uh, a little bit too early to try and say that any one of these are YouTube worthy yet. Gonna have to really, um... No, oh, ah, dang it, I've killed a few enemies. Say lovey, I suppose. No, ah, 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 they hit me out of the animation. Where is the exit to this area? <laughs> Okay, special runs only for the Twitch viewers. It's true. You, my special little pog champs. As I desperately try and get through here. All right, I can't even kill that enemy to get the thing. There's a morass, which, I don't know, it seems more likely that I probably want to, um... Ah, of course. <laughs> Had to be the invisible enemy right there. Nope. Ah, come on now. And somehow an elite enemy died. I don't even know how that happened. Um. Good. Okay. At least I can now can actually find the exit to this area, which was quite difficult to do before this. Come on. There we go. Oh. We're never going to get a real Cursed Sword showcase? No, well, probably not. I mean, Cursed Sword is very difficult to do. That, that's been true, though, for the, for the most part. It's like, you seen how it is using Cursed Sword? He's real rough. A potion heal less? I guess I could try it. But is that really, is there really any point in doing that, though? Ah, uh, there's a morass. I should probably... Uh, should I go into the morass or should I go into the ramparts? I'm really not entirely sure. I guess I should probably just go into the, uh... I can't go into the prison if I... What the hell, do morass? Okay, yeah. Um... Oh, right. No, wait, I can't do morass because I need to kill the tick in there. Oh, man. I don't know. Well, unfortunately, it looks like I am going to have to, uh... Have to, um... Give up my pacifist ways, at least for... For the uh, for the sake of killing this single one, unfortunately. Ah well, I have to figure this out over time. Sorry, tick. You know I didn't want to do it to you. But that's just how it be, now isn't it? Now, continuing on. Unfortunately, do not really have a whole lot of healing because I did... Yeah, I guess 50% less healing from every source really does make a pretty uh, a pretty big difference. Oh, what's this legendary item? I mean, it's something I can get due to the fact that I would have to kill enemies. But, you know. Looks like the malaise does reset. Oh, does it? I didn't even notice. Uh, 
anyway. Now, of course, I'm not trying to kill these enemies. They're just dying on their own. <laughs> but you know how it goes. Seller. Again, like, I've already, like, ten enemies have died so far, and I haven't even swung my sword. Well, I swung the sword once. Nope. <laughs> We're not taking that. It's not really the run either. They made the cellar a real lore room? I mean, I, uh, well, I'd like to go check it out, but I kind of can't right now. <laughs> It's a little bit too um, hot, as you can see. And as a snowman, I would melt. Uh. The longer you stay in a biome, the more chaotic it gets. Seems to be the case. I don't know. I guess I'm just appreciative of the fact that it doesn't just like kill you very quickly. And there we go. unfortunate I can't really afford anything so I'm kind of hoping for uh I guess we're not really doing the katana run anymore so I can kind of take whatever I want really right that was reducing the malaise now still so I guess I should remember that but it's like ah who knows it's like it's much harder to do tactics yeah the whole pacifism thing, especially. You kind of want, like, a large pool of health. For a lot of this sort of stuff. Yeah, I was born after 1993. I can't cook. All I know is McDonald's, charge they phone, twerk, be bisexual, eat hot chip, and lie. I'm a big fan of eat hot chip and lie, especially. Come on now. Yeah. Tactics does have more health? Oh, good. That maybe makes it a little bit better for, um... Ah, uh, I guess I can't really... Yeah, I guess I can't really, like, go into... Well, there's not really too much over there. I'm just gonna go into the boss fight, I suppose. And there we go. All right. Ah. A little bit more health, yeah. Unfortunately, not really getting too much of an upgrade for anything due to the fact that, you know, can't really, uh... I'm actually gonna reset this because I do want the extra health right now. Um, let's take a look. I still want to do Porcupine Backpack, but it's not really gonna be all that useful for right now. Um... I guess I should probably take Tainted Flask. Although, somebody said that it was broken, right? I don't know. A little bit worrying. Oh, and it also seems like they took out uh, the Soldier's Endurance, which is... That's too bad. I, I won that. <laughs> uh, hmm. You know that I like it? I just mentioned it yesterday. Now let's take Vengeance. I think that'll probably be useful for the uh, the thing. It could be female with a super deep voice. I am not. <laughs> oh, it's green now. Interesting. Big if true. And unfortunately, once again, like I was saying, kind of can't really avoid uh, not fighting Mama Tick. Unless I got the Mushroom Boy, I guess. But that would also be killing a... Oh, I'm not an enemy, but it would be killing a friend. I don't know if I can um, condone that sort of thing. Or maybe I can. I don't know. Maybe I will. Maybe I already did. I 
Come on. I'm trying so hard, though. <laughs> you don't understand. I'm eating so many hot chip right now. <laughs> nope. Tried. So hard and got so far, etc. I should be a VTuber. <laughs> you know, I do like the fact that VTubers are keeping the ancient art of puppeteering alive. There's something about that especially that amuses me. <laughs> ah! Fine. Now then, if you don't mind. I said, if you do not mind. Whatever, this doesn't matter. Come on. Nice flask, bro. That's why I got the uh, corrupted flask. After all, I knew what I was doing. Come on, Doc, give me the overlay. Okay, come on now. What did I just, I got very distracted by that copy boss there for a second. What the hell? Come on. Almost there. Oh, come on. We're all, we're done already. Just like let's just finish it here. Jeez. Huh. That tells you. Takes so long to get through some of this stuff. And, um, I guess I should probably be, like, looking for, uh, different items, but, oh, well. Impressive? I don't know. Was it really? <laughs> what I need to do is I need to get, like, some actual, um, significantly better items. That's a good start. Jesus, why, LeBron? Did LeBron say that? I mean, I assume that that's what they were talking about with, like, James and Braun knows the hashtags, but, like, what? Let's go to the graveyard. Nah. Oh, it's Instagram. <laughs> with a shield in the backpack, uh, you can... Yeah, I saw that. Why doesn't the gross morass water? Because uh, it's actually a slime snowman made out of slime. As you know. It's an actual quote from his grand. What the hell, LeBron? <laughs> ah, he's turned into a dad fully. <laughs> now I know. Now I didn't say that. Do not say that, Hypixian. <laughs> I did not and will not say that. For the mic. Okay, come on now. Just because I've done that seven or eight times. Okay. Ah! Ah, <laughs> oh, jeez. You guys. That's where I'm going. 
this gang? <laughs> Why does this have to be my like branding? Of all of the things. Get from Omicron. It's Omicron. It's with an I. I do kind of need like a an upgrade for this, but I also kind of like would like a, a, a you know stuff. This. No, not that, not that. Go back in there. <laughs> well, that's better. <laughs> it can be rapid. That does not make it better. <laughs> Please don't make me ban the copy pasta. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like that's how you know you made it big in, um,. in the Twitch scene, right? When you start to get copy pastas <laughs> Based on yourself. All I need to do is just have people always telling me that this streamer is fucked and I'll, I'll know I made it. Okay. I think we're all warmed up and ready to raid another streamer. You know that's never happening. <laughs> Ban everyone that's five head play. True. Very true. <laughs> okay. And now we gotta go. You only have a very limited amount of time before every enemy knows exactly where you are in the level. <laughs> Alright. At least I got... No, wait. I didn't get an upgrade. I just got a health. Alright. I need to... Oh, okay. Well, that'll work. That'll work. That'll work. So I throw down my blade. Unfortunately, I probably should have thrown in my backpack, which is where it would have been a little bit more effective. But uh, I guess I'm out of here. There is cheese down there, unfortunately. Why did I go directly into that? <laughs> What do you mean? Think about the new mobs to spawn in your place? Eh, it's about the same. I don't know. I don't really see too much of a difference here when, uh, with uh, the difficulty of... You can't put the same item in your backpack? Oh, okay. Well, I guess we're not doing that then. Ah. It's working. It's working out uh, just fine. I don't moderate. <laughs> but I made you a mod exactly for that reason. To moderate. You know. <laughs> but you have the sword. How many things, times do you think the sword got folded? Uh, several thousand. Of course. <laughs> Delete block term piss. <laughs> Sorry, boys. It's no longer real piss hours. Look, I don't want it to be like that, but that's how it is. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, I see you two are also taking the elevator. Piss all you want, everybody. Set the piss free, that's what I say. I do like that they at least wait until the elevator gets up to the top floor before trying to attack me. It's very considerate. Extraordinarily considerate, really. Wait, that's tactics now? Okay, I guess. Oh! <laughs> I must say, Yusuke's stick eating technique is uh, excellent. Is absolutely excellent. He begins with each stick in hand partially in the container. He grabs a stick with his fingertips and minimizes the risk of breaking it prematurely. Next, in one smooth motion, he brings his hand close to his mouth, so it turns into the stick is directly in front of his mouth. Then he has he definitely has a hand of a painter. Once the stick is prepared for eating, he moves his hand towards the mouth, pushing the I I don't know. Yusuke? The Persona character? Kitagawa, basically? 
Bang, bang, bang again. What did he push? Presumably the stick. <laughs> it's a Persona 5 shit post. I don't know even know what that means. I thought I was the only one shit posting on Persona 5. <laughs> ah! Probably should have died to that. There we go. At least I got finally got a uh, brutality scaling weapon. Swarm will never be good. Is it a euphemism for dick? I assume. Right? Like, right? It's a euphemism for cocaine. Oh, okay. Yusuke strikes me as a very straight edge character. I don't know. But I suppose I can't say one way or t'other. Da! I knew I was going to get stabbed as soon as I left that elevator. They somehow made Swarm even more unusable. Has eight biters and a ten second cooldown. Wow, that's terrible. Frankly, I don't even know what they're doing. <laughs> what are you ha-haing about? <laughs> well, anyway. Um... All right. Ah. Now that we've proven Doc, I just arrived. I've already restarted the run. <laughs> Are we actually going to do Japanese studying today? Yeah, but it's only been like an hour. It's like, let's at least go for like two hours before we get into that. What happened? Oh, I died. Did the crit slash for the third combo. I kind of agree with you on that one. I would like it a little bit more than trying to... Um, Charge it up. Charge weapons are... Uh, I must say, Doc's mic boring technique is absolutely excellent. He begins with the mic in his hand. It's not in my hand. It's on, like, a little arm. Uh, he grabs the mic with his fingertips, which minimizes the risk of breaking it prematurely. There's no way I could break this thing. It's very sturdy. One smooth motion, he brings both of his hands close to his mouth and turns so the mic is directly in front of his mouth. Again, it has a, a, a metal, like, arm to put it in front of my mouth. He has the hand of a painter. Once the price has been prepared for more boring, he moves Mike towards his mouth. I move my mouth towards the mic. <laughs> what are you talking about? Anyway. <laughs> Please correct all of these things. If anything, the only thing I do is have my hand at the back of the microphone so as to, you know, study it. As I am, you know, doing stuff. Uh, uh, the the copy pastas are getting intense right now. Okay, we ready to do an actual episode? I'm ready. I feel like I'm ready. I'm gonna go watch Among Us. Ah, whatever. Anyway. <laughs> All right, new alpha, new weapon, <laughs> katana, which is gonna be. Interesting. I'm looking forward to this one because it is a, I mean, it seems at least like pretty decent weapon. It's just uh, also, I don't know, aside from the fact that you can charge it up to go get a light speed dash style critical, as well as a bunch of uh, flower petals. I'm not even entirely sure what's up with that. Seems mostly, ah, you know what, let's just continue on here. There's, there, there's no way this is going to turn into a real episode over time. Oh, we had our fun with the cop of us. It's also nearly 100 viewers. I feel like I should be doing better than this. <laughs> like, you know, I'm not really respecting the position that I've been given by having 100 viewers. Oh, well. We'll just uh, continue going on. Add more melee weapons for more porcupine rolls. You know, that's true. I do have most of them turned off due to the fact that this was going to be a showcase run, but yeah. We'll do the showcase run tomorrow, whatever. Let's just get some more experience with like how everything is working at this point in time instead. Keep it at that. 
They have a lot more if you advertise on YouTube. You know YouTube would ban my channel if I advertise, if I even put Twitch in any one of the descriptions or mentioned it in a video. They have Google DeepMind for that. They would ban me. No, they won't. Yeah, they will. They've done it before and they'll do it again. <laughs> They've killed before. <laughs> yeah, but people never find me and they never will. Do you think I want people watching me talking about Voring mics? I don't. <laughs> That's for the Twitch audience. Besides, again, they will ban. Yeah, and I can't. Nope, you really can't put it in the, the backpack now. Ah, oh, well, yeah, I totally forgot about that whole thing where it's just like, I, I do kind of need to have like more melee weapons unlocked if I want to use that backpack thing. I completely forgot that I got rid of that because of the whole, uh, the whole deal. Okay. Yeah, come on now. And much nicer. Already. I sure do like attacking enemies. <laughs> or advertise your t advertise your Twitter on YouTube. No, I don't want to do that. I don't want people looking at my Twitter. Snowman looks really weird. Yeah. True. Very true. <laughs> Uh, others openly advertise. No, but the thing is, they, they're about to get banned. Not me, though, because I don't advertise. Now, with tactic backpack mutation for some insane synergy, I don't know if that would work all that well, would it? Really not quite sure. I should, yeah, let's go into the sewers. Why not? Kind of been doing, like, everything here. Otherwise, you can start up the charge in mid-air. Probably going to actually utilize that quite a bit coming up here. Okay, you can't dash. I, I'm noticing right now you can't actually dash through uh, projectiles, which is interesting. Have to keep that in mind. You can dash through regular enemy attacks, but not projectiles, it looks like. Hmm. Ugh. Copy pastas never have any meaning. They're just copyable to pastas. Stop the spam or I'll have to moderate. Uh. I realized Hypixian is a mod. Of course Hypixian is a mod. He was like the first mod here. Hokuto's boat was in the backpack. It's kind of broken. Don't usually go for tack, so I don't have a point of reference on that. Yeah, I don't know, actually. Would be something to think about, though. I guess I'll try it. I'm sure I'll be able to find a... Unless I go do a different um, custom mode run. Yeah. Kind of need to do the whole thing. Where I don't have more than one melee weapon on I think they have more melee weapon on weapons unlocked I think is the the real message of this run fortunately that is also going to extend to like all of the uh, other all the other um come on now showcase runs I'm doing from now on too ah we'll see Take that right on. <laughs> you jokester. Burn the ground, which feels weird for a snowman, but I'm not going to take that. I hope they add more items. I don't know. I think that uh, <laughs> as of right now, we still have a lot of items in dead cells in general. Yeah, I'm just going to go for it, unfortunately. And there we are. I 
new DLC in 2021. That's also true. This is kind of like a um, aperitif for that. So we'll get more stuff soon enough. At least that's the, the assumption. I don't know. Either way, any more opportunity to play Dead Cells is welcome by me. Yeah, okay. Here we go. Why are we still here just to suffer? <laughs> yes. Continue to suffer for me. Your pain is what I desire. Good. Good. Ah. The war on Mars? I don't know. After they took all the moms, I think that I, I was just like, what more could they possibly need? These are references to things. <laughs> what time did you go to sleep this morning? 3 a.m. or so? Why do you ask? Like, at the usual time, really. I woke up about 8 a.m. As you do. Look, when you've got a job, you got a job, you need to uh, wake up at a specific time regardless of when you go to sleep. And that's me. Are you going to drop channel points so I can force you to play Nuclear Throne? A Nuclear Throne is already on the list. It was on the list by the person who suggested, uh, well, who suggested, who made me play Risk of Rain 2. So it's at the bottom of the list. So, yeah. In case you were wondering. Well, damn. Um, uh, again, I do like the combo that you get from this, so I'm going to take it. Besides, what does uh, two times damage really matter in this case anyway? Nice. Oh, that's exactly what I need here, too. Perfect. How many places the games move off the list? Uh, to the place that somebody last suggested it. Or did it goes behind all of the other people who have bumped it up. Unless you bump it up multiple times, then it goes even higher than that. For example, Omicron was supposed to be like the 15th game in the list, but they got bob that got bumped up. Same thing with Tower Climb. It's Katana, but it will never get uh, Temporal Distortion back. It's quite unfortunate, isn't it? Ah, uh, well. I mean, I can't say that it's like I don't expect it to come back. But. I mean, I can't say I expect it to come back, but, you know. It's just how it is. Ice Black Blast in the backpack? I forgot. This is a new thing to me, you know. All right. And there we go. West of Dead? But I'd rather not die of boredom. I don't actually know what that is. You. <laughs> okay. Uh, fires a projectile, said weapon, doing 25% of the normal damages. Uh-huh. <laughs> After rolling with a ranged weapon and backpack, fires a projectile. Okay. So that's how. Uh, all right, all right. I was trying to figure that out <laughs> because it's just like, you need to attack. Okay, yeah, that makes a little bit more sense. Hmm, seems good. Cool. And eh, nothing of interest, though. 
Fire infinite war javelins. Yeah, I mean, I can see, like, some, a lot of very, uh, I don't know, um, exploitable type of things you could possibly do with it, considering how it works. Okay. Die already. All right, that was pretty dope. I, there's apparently some cool stuff you can do with this thing. It's just hard to kind of line that up. You like boomer shooters? Boomer shooters? Like, what, what's, what's a boomer shooter? <laughs> like, bullet storm? <laughs> Expanding the backpack to uh, be a little bit more creative. I, I agree. I like that idea, too. Yep. 50% of the damage is interesting. Oh, because that's a uh, two-hander. You can't put that in the backpack. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay, fine, fine, fine. Boomer humor. I should probably go get the 50 kills. Or, uh, 60 kills, I mean, right? Games like Doom and Duke Nukem. Yeah, I like them well enough. I, haven't I didn't really play them back in the day, but from what I played now, I'd say so. Right, and come on, get that 60. Crap. There we go. All right, get out of here then. Should play dick kick him some someday. My name is Dookie Nuki, and I'm here to kick go. Fuck you. <laughs> Those alien bastards are gonna pay for shooting up my car. Fuck year. Oh yeah, uh, oh yeah. Uh, um, yeah, so. What was I even talking about now? I, I've entirely forgotten. <laughs> I guess just give me this. Why do you sound like the Star Trek guy? Forget his name. William Shatner? Do his voice for the rest of the for the rest of the stream? Oh, George Takei? I, I don't know, it's just how George Takei talks. <laughs> okay. I assume. It's not even Dick Kickham. <laughs> no, it's not. Dick Kickham's the guy who says fuck here. It's John St. John, also the voice of Big the Cat, of course, as we all know. Famously, the voice of Big the Cat. Come on, I guess if I kill elites, it goes down faster, right? Bruh. Bruh. Oh! It reduces the number by 50%, but it apparently still curses you when you eat food. They did not say that! I do want to make that clear. They did not say that it still curses you when you eat food. That's kind of important information! I have thought they got rid of that, which is why I took it. Of course. Hmm. Uh, slightly worrying. Ooh, that was close. I'm hoping for a curse rework. I'd still be okay if we ever actually saw that sort of thing, because I still think one hit and you die is very harsh. Ugh. Not the enemy I want to kill. 
There we go. Uptime? Uh, about 136. Not a whole lot, really. Still kind of a uh, early stream, all things considered. Does still like put the? There we go. Does still like put the the um, debuff on them and everything, which is pretty nice. Ah, damn it! Now, oh, oh, I got hit by the Inquisitor. I missed it. I missed it. Dang. Hashtag honey. I love you, honey. <laughs> hey, viewer Chan. I love you, honey, baby. <laughs> oh, lol, you died. <laughs> I want to be the Bashi nonsense. Um, hmm. Feels appropriate. And oh, honey, honey, you do, 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 oh, sugar, sugar, you are my candy girl, and you got me wanting you. We are. Oh, nice block there. Thanks. I thought it was pretty good. Nothing personnel kid. So that's what the honey command does. Yeah, just the, anytime you need. Oh, senior slicer is now um, brutality scaling. Interesting. That's good. That's still one of the items that I have yet to do. <laughs> That means that I don't have to do it in tactics. Doc, when will I receive your love? Okay, fine. Ah, oh, sugar, sugar. Do, 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 do. Oh, honey, honey. Do, 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 do. Right on stone, you're my candy girl. And you got me wanting you. All right. Sydney slicing is pretty brutal. It's true. Anybody else want a song? <laughs> There we go. Good stuff. Now, Vera Chan, you already got one. You don't get multiple ones here. <laughs> I want a Grease song. Uh, it's uh, Grease Lightning. That's all I know. Ah, uh, let's bowl, let's bowl, let's rock and roll. That's from Grease 2? Does that work? <laughs> Does it have to be the original one? Why do I know Grease 2 songs? Well... <laughs> We're going to score tonight. Okay, fine. <laughs> Guess we're not. I don't know. I don't know the original degrees. Seems like that critical might be pretty good if I do have like a free synergy on it. I was going to say. Got to go do mine grinding in Minecraft. Like literal grinding, because I've seen some of the mods out there. You make like making flour. <laughs> okay, and give me this. Sing the Bing Bang Wahoo game. What? <laughs> Just need an ice pl blast in the backpack. Could be okay. I don't know. Guys, mods are gone. Let's spam chat. You've already been spamming chat. What are you talking about? <laughs> no, I'm just building my base and taking something like 30 hours so far. Eh, I don't know why. Bases. You seen the bases I'm making like Terraria? Oh, I totally forgot to go open up more uh, melee weapons. Ah, dang it again. Ah, dodgies again. 
Give me combo. That's a fun. That's a fun thing here. Oh, do the Mario. Swing your arms from side to side. Let's do the Mario. Take one step and then again. Do the Mario. All together now. Da 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 the Mario. Da 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 I hope you had the time of your life. Just like that. We saw I know it stopped being a YouTube episode. That's been a while now. Eat your arms and then again. What did I just join into? Ah, uh, totally normal dad cell stream. Get ready to be TMCA'd. Oh no, the estate of uh, Bob Hoskins is gonna get me. Again! I did. I do like that I lost like 20 viewers for doing that, by the way. Ah. <laughs> uh. That's important to me. <laughs> Although that might be because I did die in the last run. I don't know. Might be one or the other. <laughs> Equal chances of both. Ah. And there we go. Have you heard the Mario 3 Masturbation song? I don't like that that one. I, I don't like that one. No, that, that's it. I don't like it. <laughs> Brad. <laughs> oh, gonna have to get used to some of this stuff here, eh? Oh, lol. <laughs> Let's go do like a normal mode run rather than screwing around with Katana. Which I might end up screwing around with Katana anyway. So, you know. Katana deals so little damage. I think that might be, you know, like, it, it is alpha and everything. So that might be something to change up later. It could also be just, like, weird stat distributions. No synergies. Blah, blah, blah. You know how it goes. Oh, it's no longer survival scaling, the, uh, the thing. Good. Nope. Uh, you gotta drop down there to do that. Ah. I mean, I got back up to 100% health immediately, but still. <laughs> now, wait. This is not this is brutality scaling anymore. Ah, well, we'll figure this out. Why rip again? Because I died. I thought that was obvious. All right, anyway. Barnacle still not changed at all, though, unfortunately. So, you know. Good, good. Yeah, it means Frick. <laughs> this is all very true. This is a face tanking run? I mean, it works now that there's no malaise. You can make that work for you, you know? It, it's possible. Well, there's no malaise from getting hit by enemies. You can make that for you. You can make that work for you compared to, like, the earlier versions of this. Especially because you can just do stuff like that now. Scythe Claw still remains a quite good weapon, even in spite of some of the nerfs that it's gotten in the uh, later patches. This is the one that I like using, but is, you know, a bit, uh, a bit, um, constraining on the type of builds it can make. No katana. Ah, nothing. 
Ah, uh, well. Well, if you trick the game, you'll get the right <laughs> amount of Guardian Scrolls in the next area. True! That's one of those uh, big brain plays that I don't really try to exploit too much because I don't actually know how it works. <laughs> I mean, I could try to figure it out, but... I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go all into Brutality and then switch this out soon enough. Okay, come on now. There we go. Still pretty good. Pretty good. <laughs> uh, so I just said some of the change logs. Hokuto is no longer scales with brutality. Yep, it's true. It's true. It's also been nerfed all around, so, you know. Probably not nearly as good to be using in a lot of runs, but that's just kind of how it is sometimes. Old version of face tanking with malaise with ice tonic and ar uh, with tonic and ice armor, or ice tonic and tonic and regular armor, whatever. <laughs> Rip Hokuto. Uh, it still surprises me that they took so long to do that in the first place. So, <laughs> I can't say I can't say it's not a change that I was unexpecting. That was unexpected. Yeah, there it is. Huh. Can it only be infected by the malaise every 1.2 seconds? I wonder if that even means anything anymore. Well, in the meantime, like I was saying, I am going to be using uh, Brutality as the run soon enough. I can probably actually do something with that. Make it work. Initiatives look so weird in red. Yeah. I never really used initiative at all for the most part, so I don't know. It's not it's not something that I really even think about all that much. Action tier has changed. It's been five seconds. Ah! Okay, now come on. There we go. The one who timed you off for the B script. <laughs> yes, good. B movie script. Which, by that, by the way, that whole thing about the laws of aviation is total bunk. Not real. It was something that was believed at one point in time, but not for a very long time. So, I'll just say that it's like, Jerry Seinfeld, you should be ashamed of yourself. You can take the item out of the backpack now, I don't know how. Yeah, I don't know how to do that. Also banned some key items from the script. That's right, everybody, no talking about Ray Liotta. If you liked his uh, his character in Goodfellas, sorry, no talking about him. Banned on this stream. <laughs> hey, come on. Okay, come on now. Come on. Now. Restarting the run will get rid of that shield. But I don't want to get rid of the shield. I want to keep it. Sell it later to a collector. And there we are. There we are. Do you think that the Dunkachino commercial in Jack and Jill would have been better received if it was Ray Liotta? I don't. I think that it was perfect with Dunkachino. It would also, of course, be Ray, Ray Liate. Is Hokuto an unbanned weapon now? I guess. <laughs> I don't. I don't actually know. We're gonna have to see how that turns out, especially after they get through the the whole alpha phase of this uh, fun adventure. Good. I like the Dunkachino commercial, though. Of course you did. Everybody did. 
What's my name? I can't believe I've gotten hit by that twice now in one stream. Come on, people, tell me what's my name. We're not gonna continue the run until you tell me what my name is. <laughs> Smoke bomb only buff damage of melee weapons? I think. Bruh is your name. Come on. Bug Papa, come on. I have so many Hayabusa gauntlets. Ox Spinbird, come on now. People, it's Dunkachino. For Christ's sake. It's like you weren't even paying attention to the rest of the stream right now. It's a whole new game, Dunkachino. If you want creamy goodness, I'm your friend. Say hello to my uh, mocha blend. Yeah. Okay. Uh, uh, okay. There we are. Attica, hua, a lot to light. This whole trial is out of sight. Pull me back in with hazelnut something. God, I'm trying to remember the. Ah, come on now. You know I didn't want to do that. There we are. Ah, one gold. Excellent. It's entirely worth uh, carrying that with me. Time to go up my malaise status by a lot. Tay. You know, like Ray Liotta. Ah. Wow, that actually ups it by a lot. <laughs> that was true. <laughs> would wrenching whip in the backpack pull enemies weirdly? I hope so. That seems like that would be fun. It's like you people have not even seen Jack and Jill. Downright shameful. Cool. I can't tell what's in what slot right now because of uh, the backpack co constantly being on screen. I keep pressing the wrong thing. Down a charge, eh, it's fine. It's fine. I'll recover from this totally okay. I'm gonna spam till you sing the McDLT song. Uh, a quarter pound of beef on the hot, hot side, so the hot stays hot. Lettuce and tomato on the cool, cool side, so the cool stays cool. It's a new McDLT. It's running through the level, ignoring enemies with new malaise. <laughs> Go watch the previous part of the, the thing. Ooh. Woo. We'll actually take that. And unfortunately, I'm going to have to go. What about the gas ad? Uh, gas, gas, gas. I'm going to step on the gas. There we are. Annoying, but manageable. That's what they say about me. Snowman throwing around. Oh, come on now. Snowman throwing around uh, fireballs is kind of a strange sight, now, isn't it? Okay. 
Okay. Right, again, I keep forgetting what's what because the backpack is there, kind of messing me up. Good. All right, anybody else want to spawn in here while I'm at this? Jeez, I tell you. And the answer is yes. You know what? Send me down Paradise City. Ah! <laughs> I don't care. I want to see what it's like uh, with full malaise. Why not? It seems fun. And... At least does that. Okay, give me something a little bit more substantial. And also you too. Just for fun. There's a cheese diet? Yeah, I know, right? I was so excited that my voice broke there, I think. <laughs> Oh, boy. Anyway, I do love Machata. Okay. There we are. So I apparently cannot deal with all these enemies at once right now. Come on, now. You're not going to be able to get me like this. People were saying it's just like, oh, I'll speed run more. But it does seem like it's a lot easier if you just go slower, really. Oh, I, hey, come on now. I am going to have to actually use a potion charge at this rate. <sighs> Get to 100%? Apparently I can't. <laughs> it seems like uh, it is... It is um, not at all uh, all that easy to do. Change my malaise because people complained about it? Ever complained about it? I, I, I don't know. I feel like malaise is probably like the number one thing you would complain about with the, the thing. Mob attack speed increased quite a lot? No. No? Seems pretty normal to me. It was just uh, frustrating because obviously what happened there was I got hit uh, a couple unlucky hits followed by a... Um, uh, God, what, what am I trying to even think of? Uh, a couple knife throwers there, which sort of snuck up on me as they are wont to do. Okay. Getting punished for playing badly on a high difficulty mode seems okay to me. Eh, I don't know. Seems excessive. Let's see, I didn't even notice that the boys axe is now a um, survival skin weapon, which is interesting. Okay, and that's much easier. Actually, burnt ground one dodge is okay, but I think I would rather have like a little bit of a reduction on other stuff right now. The the ranged attacks and all that. Did they change Valmont's whip at all? No, I think that one's actually is still scaling the exact same, which is not true for a lot of other weapons in the game right now that used to be scaling with uh, tactics and like but it's like you know it is a thing unto itself and I will actually take this why not we need is a Spartan sandal in the backpack literally most OP weapon it would probably just kick away enemies right <laughs> which I mean I think could be good 
I don't know. Yeah, give me that. You want to see the malaise? Let's get that malaise. Oh, yeah, do it, do it. Got to go get myself hurt a little bit before I can take that again. <laughs> Gonna miss survival hemorrhage. Survival's still pretty good. I mean, uh, hemorrhage is still pretty good. If anything, I think it works a little bit more with the whole, uh... Uh, you know. You know what I'm trying to talk about. Brutality. Like, it fits it with that build a little bit more. Alright, there's also another regular cheese down there. Rapier in main hand and Spartan sandals and backpack works pretty well. Doesn't surprise me. Now, I do need to get hit once. That'll work. No, I got back up to 100% health instantly. <laughs> Okay, there we go. It's me, the big cheese. I think at this rate, what I'm probably going to end up doing is just do a traditional episode for the katana. Just because the changes here are making it a little bit difficult to... <laughs> yeah, we're, we're going to get, like, the real talk right now and not the meme garbage that the stream has been known for. It does seem like a lot of the changes with... Ta with uh, not tactics, but uh, the, the malaise is... Like, actually pretty substantial and quite difficult. So, I think that I, what I might end up doing is not doing this on stream, just because, of course, streaming is a bit more of, like, a, a mental exercise compared to just doing episodes on my own. So, it, it, it will probably end up being that I will do a more traditional episode for the Katana run. We'll just do, like I said, um, meme garbage for, for streams, as we've been doing before. You enjoy a uh, new a new Glarus? What the the beer company? Yeah, I've, I've had a spot a cow quite a few times. It's good. I come here for the ship posting. Well, good. This is what you're getting. <laughs> but like I said, that's the real talk answer. Where it's like basically, it is actually a quite difficult change with how malaise is now. So, it seems like trying to do an actual video is just just a little bit out of reach for the time being. And I'm gonna I'm gonna have to like concentrate a little bit more than this. Maybe even like do some post commentary if it gets real bad. It was uh, the same thing when they introduced four and five cell mode, especially with malaise in the first place, and when they introduced cell difficulties additionally. So yeah, it is. Uh, I wouldn't say don't expect like too much big progress right now. We'll we'll be doing that separately. Okay. Uh, not to be a fanboy, but I'm stoked that I finally caught a stream. Your videos help me keep me entertained and distracted during my divorce for the past few months. Ah, that's really rough. Yeah, I hope you're, I hope you're doing okay. I mean, you know, sometimes it is, like, the best thing for both people just to end relationships, even as painful as it might be. So, I hope that it is at least amicable, if nothing else. Again, since we're just doing real talk right now. <laughs> Why not? Good. There we are. Okay, okay, and okay. We're all fanboys here, including myself. <laughs> As I was talking about, what, simping for VTubers earlier? <laughs> As you do. As you do. And the weird thing with getting into that is that with getting into like the whole VTuber scene is the fact that like I actually followed quite a few of those people even before they started doing VTuber stuff. And then it's just like, oh, I guess this is a natural extension of what I've been doing, of what I've already enjoyed before. Ah, come on now. We were right at the last second there. Just noticing that he's a snowman. Yeah. The transformation was difficult, but uh, I think the benefits were, were worth it. <laughs> uh. Bruh, what do you mean? Okay, now, uh, come on now. Well, I guess I'm going to go take the cheese anyway. <laughs> yes, Rex, what is it? Firebird with big boots. I mean, what? You know, wouldn't that just be? Uh, there is already one like that. It was what? Kiara Takanashi? That's right. 
for the Hollow Live crew. How's the alpha update so so far? Pretty rough, actually. Like the changes with the Malays are uh, of a different beast than I'm used to, and I'm having trouble, uh, kind of. You know. You mean bad? <laughs> yes. I'm getting that. Yeah, it's really just the Hatsune Mika wig. Bray. A bray. With big boobs. <laughs> Unlike ha normal Hatsune Miku. I don't actually even remember what normal Hatsune Miku looks like. I just know what her wig looks like at this point. It becomes so deadened inside. <laughs> Hey. Okay. That pedestal do be kind of thick. Did you call it a pedestal? I just called it a wig stand. Again, it's just like totally out of depth enemies are, are really, really harsh in my buzz here. Oh, man. That's rough. Uh, that's rough. You don't usually encounter uh, orb casters in places where they can snipe you like that. Because they're because the slumbering sanctuary is usually a pretty small area, and even the larger parts of it are fairly uh, constrained in how they work. Oh boy, oh boy. Also, oh, I see that uh, cluster grenade is now survival scaling, which is neat. Okay. Oh, that was a sick combo. I know, right? <laughs> When the stealth automaton start to appear, that's also a little bit rough. But at least I'm kind of used to that to, uh, because of the times that I have gone through the the clock tower. Ugh. this is gonna be this is gonna be a tough a, a tough update, a tough and rough update at once. <laughs> of course, I kind of expect that when it comes to a lot of the uh, the bigger alpha updates when they really try to change up things a lot. That's just kind of how it goes. It'll take a little while to adjust, and then once you get it, you get it. Higher melee is more frequent and faster the attack speed. I still have not noticed it, but yeah, I kind of assumed as much as people are saying it. Is that melee is building on its own? Oh, my melee is moving on its own, Oni-chan. Hey, chat coon. Ah, come on now. Spawns should be restricted to the biome you're in. I think, I, I don't know. I think that it's like, it is, this makes sense in the context of being a pretty difficult challenge once you get to high cell difficulty. I don't, I can't really like, ugh be too frustrated with it at all or anything like that. It's just, man, is it rough. <laughs> That's the whole, um, that is the whole of the update ethos, though. So, what can you really say? There we go. I knew that was a risk going into that, but I actually managed to kill him before he even smacked me, which is kind of fun. It was already a huge challenge, and now it's different. Look, I mean, it's not even so. I don't even know if it's all that much more difficult. It's just different, and that's uh, that's something to get used to just by itself. Certainly, it's like it is a it is a uh, teetering threshold we sit on with dead cells. High cell difficulty has never been the most balanced thing, after all. Something you can get used to, you can adjust to over time, but not really something I would say is uh, extremely fair. <laughs> It is what it is, and now it's different. So I gotta get used to that. Sandals? Was that were there sandals up there? I didn't even see. We can check out how that works. I'm kind of curious myself. Although I am sort of working towards a ah whatever. Let's go with the thing. I was going survival, but it's like I'm not that committed to it yet. We got some time before we truly get into the. Actually, I might just die here instead. <laughs> Also, I do notice now that um, my shield's brutality scaling, which is interesting. I have six boss cell. 
Uh, I don't know if we're ever going to see a six bozo. Indeed, you died here. I did. Well, anyway, I think that what I'm going to do is about two hours of dead cells. The usual for this sort of thing. We'll kind of like end it out here. Maybe do a, uh, a different like game for right now. But like I said, this will be something that I will go and explore a little bit later. True ending behind six boss cells. If it's not already behind boss cells, what would true, true ending be? You fight malaise itself? Like the, the, like the freaking, um, the, the, the derelict ship in environmental station alpha. <laughs> you fight your past self. I guess that would make some sense, wouldn't it? Yeah. Fight the forge master. You fight yourself. Trust no one, not even yourself. <laughs> With a katana. <laughs> you know. How it goes. <laughs> Mirror matches are cool, but that's kind of why we have the Hand of the King in the first place. He's sort of already like that. thats He's, he's wearing, like, the King's Royal Guard clothing, which is what you'd normally wear most of the time. Yeah, the fight at the final cutscene. That, that, that's what I assumed you were referring to, but, you know. The poor lad who reforges stuff. Not Gion? I would rather fight Gion. Oh, yeah, you invade other players would actually be a good idea. I like that one. You fight the skeleton to your left? He's already gone. He's already a boss. Come on now. <laughs> he, he, he expanded like six times his size and became a boss. Uh, shopkeepers fighting them would actually be a thing, though. So many other games with that, but not in the, on this yet. Anyway. Spider in the sepulchre. She still has nothing to do. It's unfortunate. Ugh. Well, anyway, let's get the let's get the fire ambiance on and uh, go do the other thing. I mean, invading boss fights are a thing, like in the Dark Souls. Oh my fucking god! I just looked at my Google search history, <laughs> forgetting what I had recently looked for. <laughs> Uh Well, anyway. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, things to troll chat with, of course. <laughs> All right, hopefully the um the stream doesn't just totally uh garbage out here. But it might drop. Might drop. No, that's an advertisement. New alpha is the black screen. Oh, yeah, I should probably replace that now. Switch to, like, just chatting. 